بِاسْمِ رَبِّكَ الَّذِي خَلَقَ خَلَقَ الْإِنسَانَ مِنْ عَلَقٍ Assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Ramadan time. Alhamdulillah, I am fasting today and so far so good. I am really really happy and I appreciate Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and I am really really grateful that he has given me the ability to fast. Now let's move on to the good deed of the day. Good deed of the day. Share your knowledge. Samiha. Samiha. <laughs> you know that each day we learn something good or some new deed. If we share this with others, we will get the same reward. <laughs> and did you know that the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, "Whoever guides another, <laughs> whoever guides another to a good deed, will get a reward similar to the one who performs it." Okay. It could be your friends or family members. Oh, oh, your big, your big sister. I mean, your big brother, your big sister, your <laughs> baby brother, your big, no, your baby <laughs> sister. And you can also share a good deed to your relatives. And just like the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam said, when you share this good deed, you will get the same reward as the person doing it. Okay. Okay. Now that we've finished the good deed of the day, let's move on to Hadith. And Abi Musa radiyallahu anhu, and the Nabi sallallahu alaihi wasallam, "Qala inna al-mu'mina lil-mu'mini kalbuniyan yashuddu ba'dhu ba'dhan wa shabbaka asabi'ah muttafaqun alayh." Narrated Abu Musa radiyallahu anhu, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wasallam said, A believer to another believer is like a building whose different parts enforce each other. The Prophet then clasps his hands with the fingers interlaced. So, Samiha, listen carefully. Let's have a look at the lessons of this hadith. Okay. Number one, it is good to use simple examples such as the building to clarify the meaning and make it easy for us to understand the lesson. Number two, cooperation among Muslims strengthens our faith and makes us very strong. Oh, okay. <laughs> I want fruit. Fruit. <laughs> Number three, we should always encourage each other to be supportive and helpful, okay? Okay. So we should always be helpful and supportive with each other and we should always encourage each other to do good things. Okay. Sure. Now let's move on to the discussion section. So Samiha, okay. <laughs> I'm going to ask you some questions and you're going to answer them. Okay then. Question number one, how should we behave with each other? Um, we should behave with our parents. <laughs> no, we should be helpful <laughs> and supportive with each other and we should always encourage each other to do good things. Just as I said previously, okay? Number two, discuss one example of how we can cooperate with our classmates at school. So, Samiha, Samiha, <laughs> can you give me an example of how we can join in with our classmates at school? Yeah. So what example is that? Give me an example. An example. Of how we can join in with our friends at school. Mm, we can play with them. Yes, you can, you can you, do... You can, you can also sleep with them. No. <laughs> you can no. also, you can also, you share can, some toys. Yes, you can share some toys. You can also make you a project with teamwork in it. You can't be it. mean to them. You can't say mean words yes, to them. Yes, we should work as a team. Yeah. We should encourage each other and be very helpful. Now, let's move on to number three. Discuss one example of how we can cooperate with our brothers and sisters at home. Um, we play. Yes, maybe. We, why uh, we sleep? No. <laughs> we be 
before we stop playing, like before, before they've been, um, before they've been being um, sad in the park, but then they played in the park, gone to the gym, gone to Yes, the... you can always cooperate with each other to join in and do activities together with your yeah. brothers and sisters. Even you can go somewhere and do something fun just like we do. Yes, you can do some fun activities, yeah. but it has to be with everyone, with yeah. your brother and sister. It can also uh, be with the whole family. Yeah, even your big sister, your big brother. Yeah. I love your big sister, they love your big brother. Okay, now that we've finished our hadith, let's move on to Sora and Sora. <laughs> So, yesterday, Samiha, are you okay? Yeah, yeah. Yesterday, Samiha said Surah Al Kafirun. Now we're going to move on to Surah Al Kawthar. Why know that one? You know the Surah name, but not the full Surah. Okay, so repeat after me. A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir rajeem. A'udhu billahi minash shaitanir Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Inna a'tayna kal kawthar. Inna a'tayna kal kawthar. Fasalli li rabbika wanhar. Fasalli li rabbika wanhar. Inna shaniyaka huwa al abtar. In the shani, I avatar. Now repeat after me again. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem. A'udhu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Inna a'tayna kal kawthar. Inna a'adayna kal kawfar Fasalli li rabbika wanhar Fasalli li rabbika wanhar Inna shani'aka huwa al-abtar Inna shani'aka huwa al-abtar Well done, Samiha. Now tomorrow, you're going to say it all by yourself, okay? Okay, day. <laughs> Okay, now it's time to end the video. Before we end the video, we need to tell you something. <laughs> What's that something that we're going to say? Why don't you say it this time? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> okay. We should always teach everybody and we should teach your brothers and sisters. We're not going to go into more detail about that. So you and can also your baby your baby <laughs> sister. You can always teach your baby brothers and baby sisters, whoever you want to teach. What even your grown ups, your younger people, yeah. anyone. And just like in the hadith in the good deed of the day, you will be able to get the same reward as the person doing the good deed. So, of course you can. Yes. So if you teach someone and they learn a surah, isn't that a good deed? So you will get the reward of the person getting the good deed and doing it. Okay. <laughs> okay now, assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum everyone. <laughs> Because the Lord is